pizza. With that, what you're going to want to do for the dough is you're going to um, put uh, a teaspoon of salt, uh, two teaspoons of sugar, um, two teaspoons of olive oil, and um, two cups of water, and about mm, three cups of dough. And what you're going to want to do is knead it all together. And for the yeast, you're going to want to use a banana. Make sure it's ripe. Um, and when you knead it all together, you just keep adding flour until it's not sticky anymore. Um, and that's pretty much it for the dough. So it's going to look somewhat like this. And you'll see that it's not sticking to the bowl anymore. So that's pretty much how it is. What you're going to want to do is put some flour on the pan like so. So that way when you put the pizza dough uh, on the pan, it doesn't stick to the pan when, it, when it's cooking. Put it out, it's going to look somewhat like this. And as you can see, I put extra flour so when you're kneading the dough to be even, it doesn't stick to your fingers. And you can also put oregano when you're uh, making the dough so that it gives extra flavor to the crust. For the toppings, you can put whatever you like. I've chosen not to put sauce because I'm not too much of a fan of sauce. Uh, for the cheese, I for the base, I have put... Um, Pepper Jack Daya Cheese, and on top you'll see that it's Cheddar uh, Daya Cheese. And um, I've put Veggie Pepperoni and Veggie Canadian Bacon uh, on top of that. And then on top of that I have put Tomatoes and parsley as you can see and on top of that onions and like I said the cheddar daya cheese so it's ready to go in the oven you're going to want to preheat your oven for five minutes at 375 and then you're going to put the pizza in and let it cook for about 15 to 20 minutes, depending on whether you like soft crust or hard crust pizza. So, that's pretty much And of course, don't forget to let it cool down for about 5 to 10 minutes, so that you don't burn yourself, because nobody likes being burned. So, this is what the finished product is going to look like, if you put the same toppings that I did. And it looks so tasty. Yum, yum, yum. Don't forget to like, favorite, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Mm -hmm.